my name is Miranda and today I'm going to show you how to make these really cute line zipper patches. What you're going to need is two outer pieces, 8 by 10 inches, two lining pieces, 8 by 10 inches, a 10 inch zipper, a pair of scissors, one chopstick or something to poke out your corners, and some clips that I like to use or some pins. First thing you're going to need to do is you're going to take one of your lining pieces and put it faced up. And then you're going to take your zipper and put the zipper teeth faced up. And then you're going to take your outer piece and put it faced down. And then you are going to clip or pin along the top edge. So once you've got the top clipped, you're going to put your zipper foot on and sew along the top edge. This is what it looks like when it comes off the sewing machine. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the top layer and just pull it off and then pick up the zipper and it will be like this. And you can iron this down if you want. After that, you're going to take your other lining piece and put it faced up. Take your zipper piece and put the teeth faced up again. And then you are going to take your other outer piece and put it face down. So it's a sandwich. Once you have that clipped, you're going to sew along the top edge again. So what you're going to do after you sewed it is you're going to take the top layer and bring it up, flip it over, and then take the other top layer and flip it up. And then you're going to iron this all down. Be careful to stay away from the zipper because the zipper will melt if it is plastic. Now what you're going to do is you're going to put your regular foot on and you're just going to sew as just a seam just along the zipper. and do that to the other side as well. Okay, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna unzip your zipper about three quarters of the way. Then you're gonna take your two outer pieces and put them face together. Then you're going to put some clips on the top. And then you're going to pull it up and take your two lining pieces and put two clips or pins and make sure there's a gap so you can inside it out when you're ready. Then on the zippers, you're going to point the zipper teeth face towards your lining and clip it there too. And on this side too. Then we're going to sew. Okay, next thing you're going to do is you're going to start at one of your clips and go all the way around being careful over the zippers. You're going to stop at your other clip, leaving a gap in the middle. And don't forget to backstitch. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're going to take your fabric, fabric scissors and just trim off the corners. Just be careful not to trim the seam. And then you're going to take your regular scissors and cut off the little bits of zipper that are still around. And if anything also wasn't perfect like here, you can just also trim that off with your 
fabric scissors. Okay, and next what you're gonna do is you're gonna put your hand through the hole and pick up the line um, outer piece and pull it out. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your chopstick, whatever you're using to poke out the corners and poke out the corners. There's one. And poke out the lining corners too. Okay, now what you're gonna do after we got all the corners poked out is you're gonna sew across the top to close up the hole, back stitching on each side. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to cut all the strings from the inside. Now what you're going to do is you're just going to push your lining back into the outer. Okay. What you're gonna do is you're gonna iron it all down to make it nice and professional. Then you can put some pencils in. Zip. I hope you enjoyed making the line zipper pouch. Don't forget to like and subscribe.